Hey everybody, welcome to, to the Professor Leonard series on pre-calculus. So, since this is the first video, I want to let you know what's going to happen in this series so you, you know what to expect and you know how to progress through it. So what pre-calculus is in most courses is kind of a combination of two classes. We, we combine college algebra and we combine trigonometry. And both of those are incredibly, incredibly important to your study in calculus. A lot of teachers, myself included, kind of say you, you take calculus to, to finally fail algebra. And I say it in a joking manner because by the time you get there, you should know your stuff. And you'll be fine with it. Um, but really, there's some truth to that, that, that people kind of make it through algebra but don't really retain it. Or sort of make it through trigonometry but don't retain it. And then calculus is very difficult. Um, when that happens. So what I'm going to intend to do in this, this series is to teach you college algebra and trigonometry, so pre-calculus, in such a way that it sticks with you, in such a way that you can transition right to Calculus 1 and have a very, very good chance of success. So that's, that's my goal for this. So what you're going to see in the video titles is you're going to see the topic that we're covering, you're going to see pre-calculus, which is the whole course in, in one kind of main idea grouped together, and then you're going to see whether this is a college algebra or a trigonometry concept. In the filming, we're going to film college algebra first, so all of the videos up until about two-thirds of the way through pre-calculus is going to be college algebra, then we'll transition to trigonometry. So it'll be a very clear um, kind of stop and start of those two subjects. You need both. You need both the college algebra and the trigonometry to be successful in calculus. So whether you're taking pre-calculus or you're just taking college algebra or you're just taking trigonometry, these will work for you. Um, as I'm going through it, I want to kind of almost warn you that I'm not going to take a lot of background information for granted. So when you see me review, you're going to get a lot of that um, through this. So I'm going to be explaining concepts that perhaps you should know, but I'm not going to take for granted the fact that you do. Um, so I'm going to be explaining what a function is in its most basic form because these fundamental concepts as we're moving forward are extremely important to get perfectly right. There can be no misconceptions with this stuff as we're moving forward, otherwise you're you're sort of building information on a false premise. And so if you build all this knowledge on something that's not really um, sturdy, it's going to collapse eventually. So I'm going to make sure that our foundation is super solid as we go through. At this point, you should have some beginning algebra. You should have intermediate algebra sort of down. I will be refreshing that. That's what I was just talking about, about kind of uh, reviewing materials to go through. But other than that, you guys will be fine. It's going to be super fun. It's going to be a great course. Uh, I just want to explain to you a little bit about how it's going. So when you step into this, college algebra first, trigonometry, those two things make up pre-calculus and absolutely necessary for our success in Calculus 1. So I hope you enjoy the videos. Um, I'm enjoying making them, and so we'll see you soon.